welcome speeches we have a cool look at shadow recreate the sonic adventure 2 art and it looks perfect but do like subscribe with the bell notification follow me in the future for more content now this is something really interesting we know there's going to be a lot of references to sonic adventure 2 because that's where shadow first appeared through and now we get this as you can see they've definitely recreated this in their own type of way but the eye the hair the way how well, his hedgehog hair and the way how he's looking everything it's exactly what it should be they've done their own but instead of the arm leaning backwards like it does on the actual box instead they've just done him doing the other way instead with the arm going forward this is definitely a really 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 good look of how shadow looks in this i think it looks perfect for some reason some crazy wild reason doesn't he look really real like like he's really a real life a, a creature like i don't know why this picture makes it look really real like someone spotted him somewhere and took the picture it looks awesome though i love how shadow looks in this they have nailed it the group that does this all of them the whole team the cast palmer I hope they never lose the rights to doing Sonic movies or doing anything of doing Sonic because they do him so perfectly. Him and all the characters that we have seen, Tails, Knuckles, Shadow now, even Eggman, every one of them have been made perfect. They feel and vibe the way how they should do. Shadow feels very opposing in this whole film. He doesn't just feel like an anti-hero or a bad Sonic. He just feels like a very imposing, um, like, evil character. He actually feels menacing. He puts fear and threat into how the character is how they've done him is so amazing and i can't wait for this film but just looking at this this definitely is something that i really do feel they have nailed it to a t they have done this perfectly and i love what they have done i can't wait to see what other things we know that obviously the battle at the end or the battle with him in tokyo is going to be very much more similar to obviously sonic adventure 2 but who can tell what might change or how things might go they might go golden shadow and golden sonic and maybe have a different threat or maybe it will be just these two but i doubt it i feel like there is a third threat that we don't know about that is going to show up that maybe we'll have both sonic and knuckles obviously um sonic and um, shadow team up together to fight against it but let me know guys what you think of all this and let me know do you love how shadow is and is he already becoming your favorite but do like subscribe this is your boy future boy and about the future stay faster peeps peace